Cut. Okay. All right, so I'm here with Fiona, Hi. and she's the better part of Badger Paddles. I'd like so, to think so. Sorry, Mike. Mike's, <laughs> Mike's filming. <laughs> and uh, she's going to explain this whole hide the canoe contest. That, hide the canoe. Hide the paddle. That's there why is a canoe up for grabs, but yes, we're hiding paddles. Is the canoe this. hidden? The canoe is not hidden. Okay, no. just paddles. Just the paddles. So, yeah, you're best or, you're, yeah, she's going to explain this whole thing. <laughs> We've uh, done it again for our third year. This is the Paddle in the Park contest. And basically, there's a paddle in the park Lovely. waiting for you to find it. If you find it, you keep it. So we've gotten together with some outdoor advocates like our nice friend here, Kevin Callen, Half Wilson and Andrea Wilson. And we also have uh, Preston Sierra of Portageur.ca and his good oh, the dog, dog guy. And, and yeah, Nancy, yeah. And uh, that's Nancy right there, actually. And Preston. <laughs> Wait a minute, how did Preston the dog get into the poster? I don't see Kevin on there. <laughs> he did a lot of hard work. So uh, basically, um, we're, uh, we've got our, our nice friends here. They're going out and they're going to be hiding some paddles for us along undisclosed portage trails uh, in and around the wilderness areas of Ontario. They're so secret, I don't know where. <laughs> he doesn't even know where he's hiding his paddle. <laughs> Once you find a paddle, you uh, contact us and let us know. And when you lay clay to that, Claim to that paddle, we will send you some more prizes from our sponsors. Like what? Like what? What do we get? Well, we've got things like um, uh, we've got sleeping mats, and we've got uh, stoves, and pots, and sporks, and. Do you have a beer sponsor this year? No beer sponsors oh, this gotta year. Gotta work on that. Because we're also doing a paddle points event, and for our paddle points event, uh, we're going to get people to be taking pictures of themselves in and around doing their uh, certain uh, tasks that we assign them. So it could be anything from taking a picture of yourself portaging a canoe to sitting in a coffee shop wishing you were out there. Now, hold it now. How do they know it wasn't taken like years ago? Well, we came up with the idea to oh, yeah, ensure. Think, yeah, okay. Well, you have an idea for this. We do have an okay. idea for that. <laughs> At first, we were going to get people to carry around newspapers, like a bunch of bush hostages. But in the end, we decided we were going to do a travel card. And this is going to ensure that you took your pictures this year. Now, of course, you can upload pictures from any year that you've gone. The only thing is, is that any pictures you upload that do not include our paddle flag, or if you've somehow creatively incorporated the hashtag rewards are out there. Like on your forehead or your arm or your buttock? On your paddle. On your buttock? Uh, Would you accept that? Uh, no, we like to keep it clean if we could. But basically, um, you take pictures of yourselves, you upload them to our contest, uh, share them with your friends and family, and you will get points for that. If you have this paddle flag in, in your picture or the hashtag rewards are out there, you will get double the points for your picture. Oh, that's a good idea. So if someone finds my paddle mm -hmm. that I've hidden, they win the paddle, they get they to keep win. the paddle. They're they nice paddles, the paddle. by the way. Do we have a paddle? We don't. Oh, no, no, we hid them. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, we hid them. They're good. But you're looking for a paddle in a black sock, and it will have be tagged with a wooden collector tag like this. And it'll inform you that you have indeed won a paddle, and it'll give you instructions on who to contact and, and that you will be getting more prizes, etc. And if that guy, what's the guy from Sudbury? Uh, Chris Hawking. Chris. A double winner. Chris Hawking. Oh, no, I don't. Make good comments about that man. Chris, if you're out there, if you find my paddle, I'm taking it back. Because he found the one in, in uh, Algonquin mm -hmm. in one day. Yes. He didn't sleep over in the woods. No, he didn't. It was nope. a day trip on a kayak. Day trip in the kayak. He went from Sudbury all the way down the bottom end of Algonquin, went across Obiongo, across a whole bunch of portages, found the paddle, came back all the way to the Sudbury and had dinner at his place. Yes. All right. Then the next year, I was in the Clarny and I go, he's not finding this paddle. So I put it at the huge portage going to uh, Great Mountain Lake. No way will this man be able to get to this in one day. He did. He paddled all the way up Great Mountain, got the paddle, went all the way back to Sudbury and had dinner again. Well, I hope you're going to challenge him extra this year because I think that'd be awesome. How would just hand on the paddle? He's got to work for that hat trick. We've got to work for that, hat, that paddle trick, I guess you would call it. Okay, Chris, <laughs> if you find one of my two paddles I've hidden, Good luck to you, but I will actually even give you another prize, secret prize, if you sleep over while looking. <laughs> you don't, these are not, these are available for purchase if you'd like a waterproof version, but they're also free for download on our website. Uh, you just can click, uh, go to our website and uh, if you click on there, you can print them out and you just can pick your favorite. We have 
ones with just the male lone portage or the female lone portage or you can have your your <laughs> friend really? along well, yes. wait, seriously so there's one with a dog yeah one with male and one with female yeah and there's a female with a dog too <laughs> so people can pick their favorite the one that relates the most to their canoeing yeah. experience and you not like you use this decal um or your your flag that you printed out for free uh and it's just it's a part of like an advocacy campaign and making people aware of all the rewards of spending time in nature so uh in order to not only are you advocating for all the great rewards that are out there but you're also going to be getting your chance to win some prizes as well it is good and the reason why i agreed to do this like a few years back we started this yes. right was it they you know um, uh, uh, mike and fiona said hey we're looking for a way to get people out in nature more and this is the idea and, they, and you know it's great it's fantastic how do you win the canoe because that's the big prize the canoe is the big prize so um the way the, the canoe is going to be a paddle points prize so that'll be part of the paddle points event and the canoe will be given to the person who um, we have four categories in our paddle points we have explorer class pathfinder class voyager class and the top class of wilderness guide and the top person who gets wow. the most points in the wilderness guide class is the one who's going to walk away with a brand new Novacraft prospector canoe at the end of the at, nice. at the end of september um, if by chance we have a, a few people with the same number of points and there's a tie then we're going to pick a random winner out of those eligible points people you know so i've spent a bit of time with mike and he was polishing paddles and oiling them stuff of that do you uh <laughs> mow the lawn with no clothes on or no no I, I well you had to think about that mike. <laughs> <laughs> and then i talked to you I, I gotta say like you got the better job i think he's staying in in the little room with oil too much because like uh, he had not much to say and I don't even think he knows you're doing this contest. He knows nothing about this. In fact, if he knew we were doing this, I'd be in a lot of trouble. He does not like to give away paddles for free. He's a hermit and you're not. Okay, <laughs> we got that settled. Badger paddles, Mike's a hermit, Fiona's not, and she's the brain behind the bronze. <laughs>